All right, so we're going to make another attempt at this. My name is Bradley Reeves. You uh, probably know me from my column, um, Deep Analysis, uh, where I write under the pen name of Nickel Bolas at the website www.mtgdecktex.com. So today I'm doing an unboxing video for um, Eternal Master Set. Um, so let's get started. those Elfheimer fans out there, uh, you might recognize the uh, eerie shape holding the scroll, Yoko Jinzo. There's the proof. you can kind of see all the stacks. Okay, folks. Let's see what we got. Not a fan, not a fan. Vampire Tutor foiled carrying feeder. That's pretty good. Gamble. Yeah, fold commune with gods. It's not bad. It's not bad packs. Uh, a little lacking on the uncommons, but uh, it's alright. Maelstrom Wander, full of deep analysis. Oh, my spirit animal. Okay, so that's two mythics in three packs. Get out of there, get in my bind up. Oops, never mind, 
changers. Smurfs, Minus Automaton, Blood Artist, Soul Catcher. Okay, so here's the crap pack. And a full Desperate Sun. Okay. <clears throat> Can't win them all. Now, I will tell you, this is my third box. I, uh, and I have one more box left. <clears throat> so hopefully, <clears throat> things will work out well. Brainstorm. Heritage Druid. Thank the good Lord. Fold Harmonize. Okay, so that was a that was a very good pack. That was above average pack for sure. <clears throat> so we've had one bad rare. Now obviously this guy has Wizard on the Common before and it sucks that he's a rare, but not much I can do about it. Blotch Elf, Him to Turok, Zealous Persecution, Green Sun Zenith, Foiled Worn Power Stone. Very nice. <clears throat> so, so far we've had exactly one bad rare. <clears throat> Some of the uncommons have been not great. This flame jab, enemy dead, equal to life, and full dim uh, backwater. Um, obviously, this, like I said, this being my third box, I'm looking for certain things to try to finish out what I pulled already. Progress. Okay, braids not great. Four carbonized. <laughs> Try to get my stacks together. <clears throat> All right, so through eight packs. We've, we've had three crap rares. It's very good rares and mythics. <clears throat> now, if you don't know, Peregrine Drake was once an uncommon from Urza Saga. It's now been downgraded to a common. So, for those, for those folks who play the pauper format, that is being a common, very good for you guys. Emperor Crocodile. This is another one that was originally a rare in Ursus Destiny. It's now a common. Cry Speculation. Ah, Wasteland. Four Blossoming Sands. Champion of the 75 Wyvern Days. And there's another crapper. Call of the Skybreak. Full get to Slinger, though. That's pretty. Now, this is one of those boxes that you kind of have to kind of have to deal with the, the crap, unfortunately. <clears throat> if you're gonna get if you're gonna get good pulls, you're gonna also get crap pulls. <clears throat>
There's my spirit anim animal again. Prismatic limbs, which I don't have any copies of. Okay, this is another one I'm kind of sad about them bumping to a rare. Old borderline mercenaries. <clears throat> so we're about half a box in. Wi-Fi emissary. Factor fiction. Invigorate. Condu. Dual caster mage. Or civic wayfinder. So dual caster mage is not really expensive, but it's it's uh, very good. Commander players are going to be looking for it. Haven't really seen it played in Legacy, but that's okay. <coughs> They can't reprint fork, so they printed fork with a body. This is another card that got bumped down to a common from a rare Elvish Vanguard. Selfed Sage, this is uh, an uncommon from Torment, uh, now printed as a common. Chances, force counterspell, uh, mana war. So before they printed cards like um, the ones that you saw with uh, uh, Reflector Mage, this was the uh, best three drop that you could deal with. Brainstorm and Evan Rolls Disc. Ooh, that, my friends. Is a foil counterspell. <clears throat> that will fetch a penny for three. <clears throat> Let me see before I forget this to. To cut off the autofocus because unfortunately that's being a pain. Okay. That should help with the rest of the video. So my apologies on that. Sometimes I forget to do that. Ancestral Mask and Crater Hellion for Thundercloud Club Library. So, here again, this is another one of those where um, they've sort of split your amazing pulls with your terrible pulls. Um, but that's okay. Things um, still have, so far has been a Better than average box from what I'm hearing from players. Alright, now here's another card. Uh, Averix, uh, who was originally an uncommon that's been printed as a common. So those players who play Pauper, this is uh, another one of those great finds. Source Plushers, Invigorate, Ticking Gnomes, eh. Serendipity free Reprint. Not very good, unfortunately. Ford Mog Fanatic. It's been a while. Been a while, sir. Uh, and, uh, so, so far, stack number two has not been as good as stack number one. Okay. 
Not Aberix. Not Memory Lapse. Has some uh, beautiful artwork on that one. Abundant Growth. Right, Armadillo Cloak, Chaos Blessing, Spirit Noble, Enlightened Tutor, Foiled Nimble Mongoose. Nice. That's a real nice. All right, so we got eight to go here. Now my first box, I didn't calculate how, how good it was off the top, uh, but um, Faith's Feathers, Temai, Prodigal Sorcerer, Mistress Factory, Sinkhole, Foiled Mystical Tutor. Hello. Okay, so this is very close to being as good as my first box. Um, um, this, like I said, this is box three for me. Uh, I have yet to pull a foil uh, mythic. But I have pulled at least one foil rare in all three boxes. All right, so the intangible virtue, terrible, uh, terrible void. Uh, but a foil Paragon Drake. Void used to be a, a great card back in the day, but it, uh, it's too expensive for Legacy. <clears throat> um, Commander, however, it's a very, very good card. <clears throat> Elite Vanguard, this is another one that had a downgrade. Uh, back in my day, we started with this as a uh, Savannah Lines as a one mana, two one creature is a rare. So it's come a long way. Night's Whisper is another one that got downgraded to a common from uncommon, which is really good. Center Chieftain, Swords to Plowshares, Prismatic Lens. Okay, so this is another one I get to complain about. Uh, Pyrokinesis was an uncommon in uh, Alliances. And it's one of these pitch spells, uh, just like Force of Will. But uh, and, um, it's been upgraded to a rare. A little Plague Witch. Okay. So, again, it's not great, not perfect, but. Some packs the uncommons are making up for a lot of stuff, and some packs they're not. It's <clears throat> I'm getting the rares. Necrotal, Keldon Champion, Phyrexian Gargantua, and there's the crop. Sphinx of the Steel Winds. Old Prismatic Winds. Yep, that's a stink. That one's a stinker. So that was my fourth mythic. Probably all this box has in this is a foil. Um, I had four mythics in my first box. Three of them were good. One was balanced, so it was terrible. Um, my second box had three really good mythics and. Um, 
This one has had four, three good, three really good, and one terrible. Yeah, speaking of crappers, love the artwork, hated this rare. Cold Rally the Peasants. Alright, boys, three to go. Juggernaut Bloodbraid Elf, Bricks and Ingester, Winter Orb, Cool Benevolent Bodyguard. So the Winter Orb was good. Yeah, the Bloodbraid Elf is, is also fantastic. <laughs> kind of hoping at some point they will put them back in the modern, but I'm not expecting it. Shows. Chain Lightning. Yeah, this is going to be good. Dragon Predator. Mother Ruins. Another one they've bumped up to a rare. Not real happy about. Holy shit. Foiled Sylvan Library. Nuts. Calcuderm, Yutsu Slinger, Relic of Progenitus, Duplicant, and Full Spirit Noble. Okay, so let's take a look at this. Alright, so these are the major uncommons with C play. And 
Legacy Modern So you'll see here I've got two invigorates, two sword splashers, two brainstorm and days, chain lightning, price progress, enemy dead, him to rock, blood artist, flame cook cell, blood wriggle, relic progenitus, mistress factory. Um, as far as most of my boxes go, uh, my first one. So. That was a decent number of uh, uncommons. I've had better, um, uh, but um, So, <clears throat> out of this box, Heritage Druid, Green Sense Inuit, Gamble, Vampire Tutor, Wasteland, and Dual Caster Mage, Enlightened Tutor, Sinkhole, Maelstrom Wonder, Duplicant, Winter Orb, Mother Wounds. So, it's one, two, Uh, two really good mythics. Um, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ten really good rares. So, 12 out of 24, 50%. Um, it's, uh, it's usually a very good number. <clears throat> but, on top of that, Foiled Harmonize, <clears throat> Foiled Worn Power Stone, Foiled Counterspell, Foiled Nimble Mongoose. <clears throat> so these are cards that Legacy players are going to want, these are cards that uh, Commander players are going to want. And then the two bombs, Foiled Mystical Tutor, Foiled Sylvan Library. So all in all, this again looks like it was above average box. Um, could have been better. Um, like I said, I don't think it's my best box, but it's close. Um, uh, also in my article this week, you'll also see a breakdown of prices of... Um, majority of the uh, expensive stuff that I pulled so you can kind of see where it falls in line with the um, um, with the average uh, this will give you a good idea if you have access to get a box of uh, eternal masters 